So as summer cools down, we start to approach different seasons and, you know, some of my favorite seasons in the year. And no, I'm not talking about autumn. I'm talking about hoodie season. is one of my favorite seasons because that's when you really get to show off your whole wardrobe and you get to accessorize the way you really want to but then you got other seasons that approach that ain't as cool and I'm talking about cuffing season and for those of you who may not know what cuffing season is that obviously just means that you don't get no bitches in this video may not be for you my man <laughs> but we're gonna explain it to you and I'm gonna walk you through it and I'm gonna explain to you why cuffing season is a scam cuffing season during the fall and winter months, people who would normally rather be single or promiscuous find themselves along with the rest of the world desiring to be cuffed or tied down by a serious relationship. The cold weather and prolonged indoor activity causes singles people to become lonely and desperate to be in a relationship. Coffee season was created by girls just the, the, to entertain the idea of a relationship because they're the ones who end up catching feelings at the end of the day. That's the thing about these girls nowadays. They just live off of attention. They crave it. They feed off of it. That's why they forehead so goddamn big. See, you, my dudes, we need to stop messing with these five heads out here. You know, man, we gotta get ourselves, you know, one of them nice little regular little, little forehead girls. <laughs> and I think it all boils down to attention because during cuffing season, it's too cold to be going out to the club no more. They can't go to the club to get the attention from all the dudes and have all the dudes texting their phone. It's too cold for that. So they gotta get you one regular dude that you could just stay with while during all those cold months and keep give you all that attention but nah we not falling for that real dudes we not falling for that cuffing season is, is brought to you with this illusion that this might turn into something when it never does like if you only get cuffed during these months then you're most likely not going to succeed in a relationship you only got in this relationship because you feel like all the holidays are coming up so you get to meet his family you get to do all this real close type of things that make you feel like you're gonna you're gonna get there you're gonna yeah you're gonna get a serious relationship. no cuffing season had to be created by a woman what dude no no dude is out here really creating that i feel like the whole point of the reason why i'm making this video is because cuffing season is a scam that's right i said it it's a scam it's a shamble it's a conspiracy going on here i want you all my brothers out there to keep that third eye open my beloveds i need y'all to understand the good word that i'm about to spit on y'all right now preseason the cuffing season normally starts around the end of September, beginning of October. You know what really comes out during the end of September, beginning of October? Madden, 2K, football season started, basketball season starting, everything that us men love has just started to come out. And they think that they're gonna take our attention away from the things that we really love for them? All the new video games come out within that time span and you ladies think y'all slick. Y'all think y'all finna slide in our lives and have us spend our money on you and not pick up the new 2K? Don't, don't fall for it, my brothers. Do not go out here and spend no money on you just, you barely know the woman. You finna get somebody. No, you ain't finna get nobody. I'm keeping my brothers protected. And all of this is women really respect a man's honesty. A man who's flat out honest to tell a girl exactly what he wants. But these girls out here nowadays do not tell you what they want. The problem is some of these girls out here do not reciprocate the same honesty. They like to leave things to the imagination so that way they can say they never said. But that's the point that I wanted to make. Girls need to be straight up nowadays. Stop calling it cuffing season. It's not cuffing season, it's I'm lonely season. That's really what it is. You can't say that about most dudes because most dudes ain't looking for a serious relationship. And why is that? Because real niggas don't catch feelings out here. Especially not during these cold months. The streets is cold, my heart's even colder. Cuffing season is a scam. I don't want none of my brothers out here falling for it, spending your money on a girl you think is about to get into a serious relationship. It's not going to be a serious relationship. I want y'all to keep that third eye open, my beloveds. I want y'all to make sure that y'all stay safe. And women, I want y'all to start being more honest about what it is that y'all want out here. So that's just the point that I wanted to make. If you laughed at any point in this video, don't forget to like the video. Leave a comment down below about any funny stories that you got during cuffing season or what your thoughts are on cuffing season. Also, don't forget to follow me on my Instagram, my Twitter, my Snapchat, and my Vine account that's not going to be that much longer because Twitter's getting rid of Vine. So I got to find something else to make for you people to follow. Everything that I'm on, it's at, it's at Evan Cumbest. So y'all make sure y'all follow me on every single one of those. And I will see you guys next week.